image plays a massive role. You'll have people stay in the comfort zone. How you come across and how you view yourself will keep you in the comfort zone and stop you taking risks. I'd wish that there'd been something like this in my own school because I was really shy when I was younger and I'd only got my confidence now since I've come to uni. Once we all started talking, it was like we'd known each other for like more than we have. I've been really impressed by the effect and like the instant effect on you within a couple of hours. Hands on hand, elbow to elbow, lift the lips. Watching that video you with me makes me feel sad because people in our world are doing that, but they're putting their lives at risk. Moving away from the mates is the hardest thing in the world but it's the most empowering thing in the world. And what you've achieved in that group is spectacular. It's been a um, complete eye-opener and it's made um, myself, my colleagues, um, working with the children today, everybody's been thinking and thinking and doing so much reflection on themselves and their lives. It feels like they could belong at a place like this now. Wow. It's been a lot away from my family my friends and everybody I know. The barriers of getting to uni can be overcome. And eventually, I got myself to university, doing something that I think is amazing. Yeah, you can get there. You can get to university. Today, you have that great chance to stop you. If we've helped you decide that you need to make some changes in your life, would you please stand? And then they ended up bringing little kids in, which I think were the best part. You know, when you've got different ages coming together, uh, interacting. It's just great to see kids like that when it's not fighting or bullying or anything like that. This company was set up to help young people reach their goals, achieve their dreams. Sometimes you have to look at what stops you. And that's all we're going to do today. All we're really going to do is have some fun. The challenge. This afternoon uh, was amazing. They didn't know that the primary children were coming in there. Over 250 odd students all together from all ages, being respectful, talking to each other. You've got students who are 17, 18, 19 year old working with year 6, 10, 11 year olds. You'd never get to see that in in life really, I guess. It's fantastic to see the amount of interaction between them all. I think it's the transformation really for all of those nervous, shy students who were coming you know, onto this campus possibly for the first time in their own school groups. And the fact that now they have, within a few hours, made new friends, got smiles on their faces and thoroughly enjoyed the experience. Be an actor. I want to be a nurse. Names I want to be a footballer. I want to be a pop star. And I want to be a game designer. We've met someone or made a new friend today. Wow. A massive. To watch young people from primary, secondary, college and the university sector working together around a common theme of of respect, the importance of the student voice, building confidence, supporting each other. I think it has just been marvellous. It felt good because instead of looking up to people, you're sort of looking down to teach them how to behave. I thought it was an absolutely brilliant day actually. It uh, opened my eyes to a lot of the barriers to learning that kids would come up against in school. But one thing I did realise was the impact it had on the whole room. There was a lot of young people in there today I was very, very proud of. I enjoyed the day because I met some new friends and I realised where I should go. It was life changing, they were inspiring, it's helped me like 
realise who I really am and like what I want to do. So I made new friends. You just believe in yourself. It was fun and I made some new friends.